center square, Joan Rivers. From the Today Show, weatherman Willard Scott. From the musical stage, Peter Allen. From Hollywood Square, Jim J. Bullock. From New York's number one morning show, Regis Philbin. From the New York Jets, Mark Gastineau. From the White House and Copper Hearings, the President and Lieutenant Colonel North. From Good Morning America, Joan London. From Good Sex, Dr. Ruth Westheimer and me, Shadow Stevens. We are the New York Hollywood Squares. And here's your host, John Davidson. Oh. Welcome to Ray. City Music Hall in New York City and to the new Hollywood Squares. Hello, Squares. Hello, John. Dr. Ruth and Shadow. Dr. Please. Ruth and Shadow Steven. <laughs> Hi, team. Hey. When going sailing, when going sailing, what does it mean when you hoist up something called the Blue Peter? Excuse me? <laughs> <laughs> you know, John knows all about this. He's nautical. He knows about Blue Peters, this right? John. <laughs> I tell you something. I know what you are thinking of, but that's not what this is really about. <laughs> so I will let Shadow answer. Well, I think that it has something remotely to do with high winds. Old Blue Peters, when they come in, you got to look out. He says it means high winds. I agree. No, this is a signal from Lord, Ad uh, Lord Nelson's time. It means you're about to set sail. Sorry. X gets a square. <laughs> Shadow Stevens doesn't know everything. We'll the great secret square game is next. But first, here's Gus, the Radio City Robo Guide. Gus? Hello, I'm Gus, your tour guide, and this is the showplace of the Nation Radio City Music Hall. The beautiful interior of this theater was declared a landmark in 1978 and was restored to its original splendor as on opening night, December 27, 1932. Game number two is always our secret square game, and the player who chooses that could win the shadow. It's a Caribbean cruise, oh. John. Yes! <laughs> you! And a companion will fly from New York to the Caribbean, and for six nights and seven days, you'll enjoy the serenity of the Caribbean on the luxurious SS Costa Riviera. Italian cruise, stylish shops, and continental dining furnished by Costa Cruises Incorporated. Let's reveal our secret square to our home audience only, and B, your turn to catch up. I, what? I can remember this answer, sir. Uh, guys, yeah. what are you seeing? <laughs> what you are seeing is a live shot of the massive hydraulics that raise and lower the elevators of Radio City Music Hall stage. You saw us being raised up at the beginning of the show. That's how we did it. We are all sitting on two or three elevators, and these are the very same type of elevators used on aircraft carriers to bring airplanes to the flight deck. The question is, which came first? The Radio City Hall elevators, Music Hall elevators, or those used on aircraft carriers. Which came first? Um, Bring her. Uh, Sir, why don't you take it? Well, uh, I only know what I'm told. Gosh, well, it, which came no, first? No, it can't be an aircraft carrier because they're all, uh, they can't be one of ours. They're all in, in uh, the Strait of Hormuz now. Uh, no, sir, they were in the Strait of Hormuz, but if you recall, you had me order them into your bathtub so you could have something to play with in there. <laughs> Guys, well, which came first, the hydraulics in Radio City Music Hall or the aircraft carrier hydraulics? Well, I, I think it's the uh, here, right here at Radio City Music Hall. Yes, that's what we'll say. You're saying Radio City came first. Yes. This is before the win. Daniel, what do you think? I'm going to have to agree with the president. Unbelievably, you are exactly right. X <laughs> Dr. Ruth and Regis Philbin as his good luck celebrities and this beautiful Mark 7. Tell us about it, Shadow. The 1988 Lincoln Mark 7 LSC. Performance, sophistication, luxury combined with aerodynamic styling furnished by Lincoln Mercury. The Lincoln Mark 7 is worth $25,770, Daniel. On the count of three, turn that key. Audience and stars, help him out. One. <laughs> 